Honourable Leader of the Opposition. Mr. Speaker, last week the Prime Minister once again reduced Canada's commitment to the fight against ISIS. For no apparent reason, Canada's contribution of surveillance aircraft was quietly cut in half. Even though he was at NATO bragging about Canada's commitments, the truth is that, that the Liberals are happy to let others do the heavy lifting when it comes to fighting radical terrorism. Can the Prime Minister name even one NATO ally who asked us to cut our contribution to the war against ISIS? The Minister of National Defense. I'm proud of the, uh, the work of uh, the, the commitments that we have made by increasing the, uh, the ground forces that have actually had a direct impact on the ground. The intelligence contributions that we have made, the role to hospital that, that we have put in place, having a direct impact on the ground, Mr. Speaker. And I can assure you, when I was at the counter diaspora, that's exactly what we talked about. And we will always continue to revamp uh, our, 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 our commitments to making sure that we are going to be a viable and credible partner to this coalition. Thank you.